Hello everybody, my name is Gandhi and welcome back to another video of Days Gone. We're going to continue this series, guys. On the last video, we helped out uh, Aaron Mike with some cho uh, chores on an area we already went before, where we had to do a puzzle and everything. Well, this time around, we just had to, uh, to get a key or some stuff, get some ammo with the help of Aaron Mike. Uh, ran into a, a couple of outlaws or stuff like that we had to shoot tr uh, through. But uh, aside from that, we also got a bounty and everything, uh, got someone, and now we're basically back here. We gotta help out uh, Ricky or some stuff, or just go with her somewhere. I'm not, we're not sure where we're going. Uh, we're not even sure if she knows where she's going, but anyways, let's just go. I don't know where she made us uh, go all the way around like that. That's kind of ridiculous when you think about it, Ricky. Where are you going? Where are you do? Okay. What's she doing? A few weeks back, we lost a man when this went down, shutting down the infirmary's respirator. Respirator? Oh, God. Ricky, look around. If you're on a respirator out here, you're already dead. What if it had been Boozer? Yeah, that's what I thought. See, we haven't had power for almost two years, but the transformers and the lines, they all check out. Well, at least they do here. I want to ride up north, check out the hydro dam, just to see why it shut no, down. Oh no, riding escort, that's Schizo's job. I don't need an escort. You lived up there, you know the area better than anyone. Deacon, you asked for my help, right? Now I'm asking for yours. Shh. Okay, good. I'm gonna go grab some of the guys nope. that can rut. No, you're not. Now we're going in quiet. We run into Copeland's men. I can handle them, but that wilderness up there is crawling with rippers and scumbags and God knows what else. More men, you know what that means? That means more attention. No, uh-uh, no, we're doing this my way. Yeah, it looks like Deke doesn't want any more hey, trouble, so well, tricky. I can understand uh, yeah. him on that uh, matter. The night, uh, in the infirmary. Would I have shot you in the face? No. Go, go, uh, let's go to my bike, guys. Didn't look in your face, you... I would have taken you outside first and then shot you in the face. <laughs> okay, so you wouldn't, you know, want to get blood all over the infirmary. Uh-huh, exactly. Now let's go. She's got a, a kind of cute, cute bike as well. If we get an early start, we can get back before dark. As long as nothing goes wrong. <laughs> well, what can go wrong? Following you. Just follow the route that I marked on your map. There's some marauder camps up there we want to stay away from. Yeah, got it. Why are you? So how did you she's end up right there, you and you're not even driving. Oh, I don't know. I don't know why she's he's getting down, guys, but whatever. Where are you from? I grew up in a little town outside of Portland. Would work in the city, couch surf, go home on weekends. Big city. Yeah, right. Only in Oregon. What was it like over there? I mean, how did you, uh, how did you get out? I don't know. Luck, I guess. Roads were backed up all the way down the coast. One giant parking lot. Well, that Valley was a war zone. Everything happened so fast. I, I, I told my friends to get out when I left. I don't think they listened to me. I, uh, I heard they nuked it. Portland? Yeah, I, I heard that too. Don't think it's true. We'd be feeling the fallout, right? Yeah. So, uh, you and Addy. You got a problem? Me? No. Come on. Just, I didn't know. You rode with us a long time. I guess it, uh, I guess it never came up. I was like you. Seemed like, uh, I don't know. Keeping your distance was just a good way to stay alive. Uh, okay, look, I shouldn't have asked. None of my business. That's why I'm at the camp. You know, chance to live a normal life again. Good luck with that. It's nothing serious. Me and Addy? Didn't look that way to me. Yeah, well, things happen fast these days. You know what I mean? Didn't ask. I wanted to tell you something. Shoot. I, uh... Look, I appreciate you going to bat for me. Uh, for me and Boozer. With Iron Mike, I mean. Wow. You are getting soft. 
Fuck off. You've never thanked me for anything. Yeah, well, maybe I never had any reason to. Okay. So where'd you and I and Mike go the other day? Wait, you said that he already told you about it. He was pretty tight-lipped. I've known Iron Mike a long time. To be honest, I, I don't think I've ever seen him so, I don't know, depressed. Where'd you go? A Sherman's camp. I heard that place was a freak show. It is, but we didn't have much of a choice. I, uh, I had an idea about sealing the caves, keep the hordes from coming through. He knew where the mining claims office was. We picked up some maps. He's going to track down some explosives. Your radio must be broken. Almost sounded like you volunteered for some shit. Well, I'm riding with you now, aren't I? Jesus. You just wanted out of marsh duty. Okay, you got me. So what happened? Something happened. Nothing, Ricky. Nothing happened. He didn't say anything? Just, no. No. Nothing happened. And no, Iron Mike didn't say anything. Like you said, he's a pretty tight-lipped guy. So I don't know why she's slowing down all of a sudden, guys. See that? See that she's so is she's going so slow. I was going at the same speed, but she's just slowed down. So that spoke a lot so far. That's because I'm trying to myself hear what the cut uh, like what they're talking about and everything. I don't have anything to say anyways, so I might as well let her talk. You know why is she going so slow? All right, dam's coming up. Take it slow near the gate. No idea who or what might be living there. Got it. Hey, we got some dialogue here, guys. What do you know? But she's still going very slow. Look how slow she's going. That's, um... Just to tell you guys really mu uh, really quick how much time it took us just to get there for some dialogue or something. Because she's going so slow. I mean, you can take it slow. But just advance a little bit more, bitch. I was uh, about to say before that glitch happened that, uh, you know, I like the character of Ricky a lot. I like her a lot. I, I, I despise her now. I absolutely despise her. She's doing that out of spite. I am telling you right now, it's just pure spite right now what she's doing to me. It's pissing me off big time. Look how slow she's going. I can't go far without her. I gotta wait for her. I'm pretty sure that's where we gotta go. That shit is ridiculous. I hate that so much, guys. Yeah, this is where we're supposed to go right here. It's fucking right already, man. Hey, what do you make it, guys? We finally made it into a fucking cutscene. Well, looks clear. Oh, I hated that glitch so much. It took me yeah. 20 minutes to we get to a it, goddamn go central on. place. All right, come on. I want to check the outflow. Where are you going? You better go, you better march slow. Yeah, there we go. Now you're speeding up. Now that I got that, got them, I, I swear, being at that, get back into your bike. Because if I have to follow you one time, one more time, Ricky, oh, no, no, no. I'm gonna flip it's my shit. Wet. There should be more water flowing out right there. She's yeah. the worst driver of all time, guys, I swear. What? what? Exactly. If the turbines were running, you'd be able to hear the hum of the lines from here. Hmm. So someone shut down the uh, turbines. All right. Well, what do we do then? There? That whole thing oh. is destroyed. Holy shit! Same thing that happened. To all the bridges, smart men in uniforms decided blowing them up would keep the hordes from coming in. Uh, hordes of refugees or hordes of freaks? Oh, you figure men like Copeland? Probably both. Hmm. All right. Come on. I want to check something out. All right. Well, what are we checking here? Oh my goodness. Look, I like Ricky, alright? I like her, but... She's just... It was just too much to follow her for 20 minutes. At slow speed, at like... 5 kilometers an hour. On a goddamn bike. Like, like that was way too much for my... For my mental health right there. Took a toll on me, that's for sure, guys. I swear. Come here, touch this. Come on. Okay. You? Hmm. you feel anything? No. Exactly. If more water was flowing, the turbines would be vibrating. Come on. All right, then. Well, what do we do about this? Up to the top, up there. Following you. 
See these pipes? They're called the penstock. Water pressure builds up from the reservoir and is pushed down through those pipes, concentrating the force of the flow, which goes right through to the turbine. How the hell do you know all this stuff? I had two older brothers who were always fixing cars and shit with my dad. He got me a job at Boeing when I was only 17. I was going to school part-time to become a mechanical engineer when shit went down. Did you ever see him again? Your dad, brothers? No. Come on, over here. Alright, let's figure this out. <clears throat> well, this is gonna be fun. So now wait, oh, oh. wait, what's, go what's going on? What are you doing? We only rode together a few months, but in all that time, I never saw you volunteer for anything. One of us has to jump down there and clear the intake. So, I'm up. <clears throat> oh, but you can stand and watch. Okay. Well, it's now or never. Let's go. Oh, she's crazy. Yeah, it's it's pretty mucked up. I think I can clear it though. Run back down to the turbine. Just, just see if it's vibrating at all. All right, all right, I'm on it. Let's go, guys. Something tells me we're gonna get jumped here. Oh, there's a bunch of zombies here. First off, I see you there. Don't you? F don't think I don't see you. All right. Don't jump me, please. Yes. We're good. Yeah, alright, so let's just uh, go back to her, I guess. Aha! You feel that vibration? Yeah, but the power lines are still dead. What? Man, oh, it couldn't be that easy, right? Alright, come on, let's check out the transformers. Man, so, uh, what are we doing here? Brothers, what this happened? is crazy. I never thought we would be doing this way back, I in Days Gone, gone guys. Over, of all games. Home. By the time I reached the house, it was deserted. The entire neighborhood was deserted. There were flyers everywhere, evacuation orders. I went to the <laughs> closest refugee camp. I did not mean to jump right there, but that's okay. Almost dead. Freaks were everywhere. <sighs> Jesus, Ricky, I'm, I'm real sorry. Yeah, it was a long time ago. Yeah, something's definitely bothering me about this place is we're definitely gonna get jumped or something. Something's gonna happen. It's bound to happen. I mean, look, this place is huge. I already went there before. I think I did end up in a shooting situation with a bunch of people. I think it's gonna happen again. I mean, this place is just bound for uh, stuff like this. I have any idea what's wrong with them? No, not a clue. Okay. Well, it might be a short in the turbine junction boxes, so let's just go down and check it out. Okay? All right. All right, so where are we going for that? So, uh, and she sure knows a lot out. about yeah, this. It seems like you're always on the verge of ripping his throat out. She must have been uh, an elect uh, electrician back, or something. Like, like she must have done that. this job before, and what? there's no way she would oh. know that much about well, um, hydro e electricity uh, before. Jesus. You know, uh, without uh, having done a job, I guess, you. about it. It was all I could do to stop her from neutering the bastard. Ouch. Right? Never piss off a woman who knows how to use a scalpel. Let's go. Here, boost me up. You got this? Let's go. There we go. Okay, got it. Here. Here, I got the gate. Oh, nice. Come Thank on. you. Junction room's right around here. So this is what I kind of like about um, Ricky. This is the type of uh, character I like. Just like Sadie Adler and like Ahsoka Tano, characters like that. Side characters, you know? I like side characters a lot. Uh, From the smell of it, some main characters I like. Like Deacon, I like him a lot, but never my like... Stay close. I don't focus really on main characters. I focus on side characters because they're the ones who help out a lot the story in uh, in the way of moving on you know okay 
Remember the drill. You light them up, I knock them down. And I like a lot characters like Ricky, who basically are, are girls that are really badass. They're just plain badass, and that's all that matters, you know? It's just pure badassness, and I love it. And there's nothing else to it, you know? There's no... There's, there's no thing like, oh, I'm a Put woman, so I need to be... Uh, I need, I need to be the big bad thing or I need to be the strongest Can thing out there. She's, Ricky's not the strongest girl. Or she's not the strongest character out there. She's not like the biggest baddie uh, ever, you know? She's just someone that's pretty cool written. Like, she's just a well written character and that's what I like, you know? That's the kind of character I like a lot. Okay, uh, do we have, can I, I cannot repair my goddamn axe because I still am missing a lot of stuff. Uh, there's a big old uh, thing right here. Am I supposed to do something about that? Not sure, guys. Where's Ricky at? I think she went the other side, yeah. Gotta follow her, guys. You got any idea Burn what we're down. supposed to do? Burn it down. Ready? Well, she's doing it already. It's a bunch of... Um, Bonuses here. Oh shit. Hold on. Yeah, alright. Let's go. Here it is. Here's one of them. No, you don't. Oh shit. Oh. There we go. Now my axe is broken, so I don't have any more of that, but that's okay. I'm just gonna have to use my. Uh, I might. Ricky's in trouble. There we go. Got you. I got you. There I go. So that zombie's out for the count. <laughs> you good? Yeah. They really don't like visitors much, do they? Well, can you blame them? Oh. Well, they better get used to this shit. You know what? As of today, I'm claiming this for Lost Lake Camp. Power to the people. <laughs> All right. Let's check the junction boxes and get the hell out of here. Well, if she's claiming this place, this yep. is definitely going to have to be like... We're definitely going to have a lot of people uh, need for this place. <laughs> yes! Houston, we have power. Nice work. <sighs> I couldn't have done it without you. Come on, let's find something to block the door and I don't want to have to come back up here every month to clean this shit out. Wait, wait, wait. You're going to be here in a month? What? No, I, I don't know. Would you just... Jesus. <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, dude. Come on. Alrighty then. So, why'd you ask about my dad and my brothers? Uh, I don't know. He just, uh, you never mentioned him before, so, um, you know, I'm sorry if I, if it's, uh, something he didn't want to talk about. No, it's fine. In fact, it reminded me of something I wanted to ask you back when we were writing together. Okay, Ricky, Ricky, not now. You can ask me later. But, no, hey, hey. Come on, we gotta get moving. Hey, you never asked uh, why I stopped riding with you and Boozer. Was I supposed to ask? I already knew why. Iron Mike's bullshit. God, Ricky, do we gotta do this now? We had been riding together for, I, I don't remember, a couple months. <laughs> do you Where come on? Okay. Okay. They were this one night, and I remember it really clearly. <clears throat> it was snowing outside, and Boozer was snoring. Remember how he used to snore? I swear, I thought <laughs> he was going to bring a horde down on us, yeah, right? Yeah, well, pretty much hasn't changed. <laughs> anyway, <clears throat> you thought everyone was asleep, and you were sitting outside by yourself like you always did, and you were staring at something. You didn't sleep the whole night. Let me see the photo, D. Come on, please. This is when I knew. What'd you know, Ricky? That I didn't want to end up like so many of us here, We're trapped in the past or running from it. I, I just, I want to look forward. Okay, not back. This isn't what you think it is, okay? Get low! Beyond the back! Find them! 
Are you sure it's them? I saw the mark on his back. We're from Lost Lake Cab. Iron Mike has a treaty. Well, that was a really good idea. Do you want to try that again? Motherfuckers. We're not supposed to shoot at us. He had an agreement. Alright, they want to work it that way. There's a goddamn sniper. Get out of here, man. Jesus. Sacrifice. Okay, 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 okay. No, that's uh, that's too much. I don't have any weapons right now. He's got a goddamn shoddy. Did he just... Did, he, uh, did you see that swift dodge right there? The hell? Why am I not doing any damage with my... Um, my, uh, my weapon? I don't know, guys. You're dead? This shit is crazy. Okay, I'm gonna need my sniper. You're dead. Alright, let's go. Oh shit, man. I'm missing all my shots. There we go, he's dead. Alright, let's go, guys. We gotta go. It's too many of them. How is she still alive? There we go, man. Good god, just die already. Okay, this shit is... No, this is too much. This is way too much. Alright, I'm done with you. Fuck this. Alright, you're pissing me off right now. I don't have time for shit like this. What do I tell you guys? Isn't this game... Like... You always know what to expect out of this game. It's ridiculous. Let me just grab two of those and I'm gonna just... There we go! Get in fire, bitch! There's another one for you! There we go, he's dead. Okay, we're good, we're good. Oh my god. Uh, we gotta get out of here. She, he's dead, he's dead, he's dead. There we go. I think that's the last. There's all of them. Man, that was crazy. I knew something would happen like this. I just knew, guys. Always does. Back in the day, dealt with a few tweakers who acted like that. I think they're on PCP or whatever that other issue is. Oh, uh, bath salts. Remember? That was becoming a thing before everything went down. Right, yeah. Come on, let's see if they messed up our bikes. Don't you think that Iron Mike's treaty with these bastards is gonna hold? I don't know. Fucking rippers after what they did to Boozer's arm. After what they did to Dick! Lisa. What? This was clutched in one of their hands. What happened? Did you guys have a run-in, you and Boozer, with, with the Rippers before you stole the antibiotics? Oh, I... I don't know. Look, whatever Carlos thinks I did, thinking it compared to what I'm gonna do to him if I ever see the son of a bitch. Come on, let's go. Looks like we got okay. some sort of warrant on us. It looks that way at least. Sure A bunch good. of missions done now. That's good. Uh, okay, I'm so following we you. just gotta ride with her again. Hopefully she doesn't slow down this time around because I do not, absolutely do not ha want to have another 20 minutes waiting for her to nice get to uh, another place. One place or another. You know? It's a long story. We got a long I, I was a member of the 10th Mountain, part of a forward unit working with the Northern Alliance. Shit, I didn't know you were in the army. Why were... You want to hear this or not? Sorry. We were advancing on Mazari Sharif. We got ambushed by a group of Taliban heading the other way, and they were in flatbed trucks decked out with ZU-23s, modified anti-aircraft guns. Big guns. Yeah, really big fucking guns. Our Humvee exploded, went over a cliff, right into the Hari. You know how hard it is to drown in Afghanistan? It's hard. The place is one giant goddamn desert. Anyway, I was thrown clear, and when I came to, the, the Humvee was upside down in the river. I swam out to see if anyone survived. I, uh, I pulled a body back to shore, and I did that seven more times. By the, 
By the time I pulled in Tanner, my Sarge, I was done. And when I came home, I don't know, I, uh, I bought a bike, spent a couple of years on the road, just moving from place to place, and, uh... Do you know well? You grew up around here, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so by the time I finally settled down, I got a job at a bike shop run by this... by this old guy named Jack. And, uh, he ran the club. The, uh, well, the press. That's what we used to call him. He patched me in himself. Wait, Jack. I remember Boozer talking about him. He was in prison or something. Some bad shit went down, and, and he ended up taking the rap for the club. Sounds like you guys were pretty tight. Okay, that's uh, crazy. Well, we got some uh, details about uh, Deacon's past right here, which is uh, it's really awesome. Awesome to have some details finally and stuff. Oh shit. There had to be one, right? Let's come back in the morning. You can get whatever tools you need and we'll finish it up then. There will be fewer freaks out. So no hot shower tonight? Okay. But I want to show you something first. Oh, Ricky, it's been a long day. Come on, you know a lot about the freaks. I just want to show you something you might not know. Come on, we're out here anyway. Shit, okay. Let's go. Can I ask you something? God, like I said before, could I stop you? Why are you still flying colors? I don't know what you mean. I mean, why do you still wear the cuts? You and Boozer, it's, it's not like you're trying to recruit anymore or, or staking out territory. No. A couple of guys I worked with at the plant wore colors on the weekend. I asked them about it once. They said they wore them as a way of saying, fuck you, to, I don't know, cops, authority, the government. So what are you rebelling against? Whatever's left. Look, we wear them because we wear them. What do you want? I mean, no idea about Boozer, but I ain't trying to say shit. It's just, cut. That's who I am. I've done a lot of stupid shit in my life, but joining the MC, well, let's just say... Sorry for the rare cut, guys. What are we doing here? I've seen the cuts of dialogues. There's so many dialogue in this video. It's crazy. Like this. When you think about it, I, I haven't, I barely talked. I, all I'm doing is listening just like you guys. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is going to be rough. There's a lot of cutscenes, lots of uh, dialogue in between the writing and stuff. So not a lot of room for me talking, but that's okay, man. Sometimes it's just these types of, uh, of games. They go back inside and what, hibernate? You mean you never went down there to see? Aha. Uh -huh. No. One time I got way too close and a dozen of them started chasing me. It's like poking a hornet's nest. Come on, let's get out of here. It's getting dark. Okay, so we're finally going back to the camp now. Okay. Okay, anyway, the other day, I, uh, I saw something you won't believe. Really? You want to talk? Here. Wait, let me guess. You saw a Nero helicopter. Wait, uh, how did you know about that? They've been spotted a few times all over Lost Lake. Shit. Why do you care? It's not like they're here to help us. From the sound of it, they shoot on sight. I don't care. Oh, sounded like you did. Yeah, well, here's the thing. My, uh, the wife... A wife of your uh, of mine is kind of uh, mixed up with the the Nero searchers, so I kind of have to go with them, you know. Hey, where the hell have you been all day? <laughs> nice to see you too. Yeah, well, Schizo said you and Deacon took off, and I was worried. Addy, I'm tired. Okay. Oh, that's rich. Hey, Deacon, thank you. Yeah, well, just let me know when you're ready to tackle that transformer. I'll be around. Sure. Bullshit. What is your problem? No, no. What is your problem? I just said I'm tired. That's it. Okay. I'm sorry. Like I said, I, w I was worried. It's not like you to just take off without talking to me. Okay. So that's it? <sighs> no. 
They've got some issues they gotta deal with there. Alright, so I heard another mission completed at least. Alright, that's good. And another mi mission uh, yeah. towards us. What is that exactly? So I remember moments of lucidity. Tracks down a Nero search field team. Alright, so another one of um, O'Brien's mission once again. How's it going? It's interesting. We got another skill point, guys. We got two of those. I forgot to equip the last one. Let me just see real quick. Uh, in this one, what are the options? So, we got uh, Thief in the Night. Uh, generate less noise when moving and dropping. That could be good, but I'm not like it's not that much of a priority. I just want these things right here. So, maybe we already have this. Green thumb. I'm gonna just go ahead and get that. See if I can't get anything else. Gear to uh, skill tree. Okay, there we go. We unlock this one at least. Meat gathered from animals. I don't care too much. Uh, catch your breath. Redu reduces cooldown on st I mean, stamina recovery. Um, here to the ground. So outlines enemy in survival mission. Oh, that would be really cool. Reduces cooldown on uh, stamina recovery. You know what? That's kind of uh, really important. I kind of need that a lot, actually. Uh, stamina is becoming a real problem for me, so definitely need that. That's cool. All right, good. So up next, I'm not sure what we're supposed to do here. We're going to turn in a couple of bounties here and there. Just to get our stuff together. All right. We're getting there in trust level, but not, but not fast enough. I kind of want it to be faster. Uh, oh, well. Yeah, yeah, Ricky still got a mission for us, though. See, Ricky still got uh, that mission she wanted to uh, give us. Let's just get it really quick. Before that, see. That's okay, no, we uh, just needed to repair a little bit. All right, we're good. Look at that. Oh, I do need my guns. I am going to yeah, need my guns, but uh, Ricky, you had a mission for me real quick? Deke, a group of men rode in, shot up the gate, and when we wouldn't let them in, they rode off. Ah, shit. Which direction? Uh, they headed west, but they didn't go far. They set up camp just north of Eden Hill. I think they might be planning another attack, so I need you to take a look. <sighs> okay, right. Yeah, I'll handle it. Thanks, Deke. Okay, so we got our mission from her. So that's the mission right here. Um, soon, as soon as I leave the camp, they're probably going to give me another mission for this camp, which is going to be ridiculous. Every time it's just the same thing, guys. Just uh, re-equip my ammo or get some ammo back, basically. Supplies. Oh, hey, look at that. There we go. We got so much money from this camp. It's, it's crazy. Schizo. Really crazy when you think about it. So, got everything here. We're good. Yep. Looks like it. Looks like we're good, guys. See you later. Uh, don't have too many scraps every time. I'm missing a lot of scraps, guys. Which way I want to go first, I'm not sure. Kind of want to do O'Brien's mission first since it's yellow, like I said earlier. We kind of want to do this one first, but I'm going to leave it here for now. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. I'm see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.